Hey there guys, what is up? It's an answer the Matman here with a new recording. Now this is going to be quite good because I'm actually going to download the YGO Pro um, Dawn of a New Era. Now this is Yu-Gi-Oh Pro. Um, there's two versions of it. There's just Yu-Gi-Oh Pro and there's Yu-Gi-Oh Pro Dawn of a New Era. Now, they're both the same, literally. Nothing really different. They both work the same way. I don't know why there actually is two games. They're both really good. Have them both on the other laptop. Um, and yeah, so I'm going to download just one of them. I like this one better, a little bit. This looks kind of cooler. And yeah, I'm going to download it now. So you're going to... I might skip it. And then I'll actually play a couple of games. I'll build a deck. I'll show you where all this stuff like So this is like a tutorial on what to do. Now... Oh, now you click on the download and there's the download link there. You don't need to worry about that. When it downloads it, I usually did the Google Drive. And it takes you up to AdFly. That's fine, you can just leave that. And basically, ignore all the ads, guys. If you, like, they'll say this, they'll say uh, $600 per day, risk free. And you'll click on it and it will give you a like Trojan horse thing and your laptop will be screwed forever. But wait until the top until it says skip ad. That is not an ad. Literally it will skip the ads. And take you to your little homepage kind of thing. On what's actually happening. Now, oh, if it says sorry there's no preview available. Um, just click download and now this bit's fine guys just click download anyway because it, it says it what it will exceed the maximum size that the Google can scan would you still like to download this file just click yes now it's 436 megabytes so it is going to be quite long so I will skip this bit until it actually downloads because it will be down there I'm going to skip it until it actually downloads guys so I'll see you later and I'll Come back when the thing downloads, and then we can do the setup. Hey there, guys! I'm back, and the download is now nearly done. Now, um, by the way, if you do subscribe to this, um, please, um, thank you very much, and say what you want. If you've already downloaded the other YGO Pro, like it's a dual network, which I've also done before. I just wanted to tell you know that you can do them as well. But anyway, it's now done, so we're gonna open it up, and yeah, yeah. So that's fine at the moment. That's all good. Now, like I said, the I am recording, so the setup may take a while. Now, I might skip the bit of the setup, but I'm going to show you the main parts just so you can see what it's like and stuff like that. Because not many things actually show you the setup because some people struggle with setups and stuff like that. I'm going to show you the best place to put them and stuff like that. Because sometimes, you know, you actually tick something and it gives you a whole load of like, browsers and stuff to do. Oh yeah, anyway, so you just click English, yep, um, accept the agreement, no one actually wants to read that. Click next, again, um, it will create a shortcut, which is easy. Yep, create a desktop item, icon, so it will come up on your desktop. Click yes, yeah, and that is basically what it's going to do, it's not going to add anything else. And click install. Now whilst I'm going to install, I'm yet again going to stop the recording, and yeah, so I'm going to see you guys after, until it's actually downloaded. Hey there guys, I'm back, it's downloaded, and yeah, like I said, it will come back down here. Um, if you click finish, it should start up automatically, unless you took that bit away. Now it's going to come up like this, and you will have to register an account. You do not have to verify your email, do not worry. There's a register button right next to it, and literally you register there. And I haven't used this in a while, so I'm going to gonna have to create one. So I will be back in a second. Hey there guys, I'm back, and now I have made the account, it's very easy, literally thing, thing, three things and you're done. Um, basically once you've done it, make sure you remember your username and password if you want it to, and click I agree to the terms of use, and click login. And it will connect, your email just not verified, would you like to verify your email now? I don't know what that does, but I just clicked no and it still worked. Now, this, now this whole game isn't always one tab, it will open up plenty of tabs, see that's where I registered and if you want to not show your computer account, get rid of the tabs now it can do that now what I want to do before you ever play this game because you can't play the game unless you make a deck 
So all you actually want to do is go to decks. But first of all, we're going to have a look at some of the stuff. So you know, we've got stuff like this, and you can actually like you know change by looking at what is some of the stuff. I've never been on here. Ugh. Okay, but looking you can add your own pictures. I mean, that's fair enough. You add your own skin because that it's like you know own skin. But I keep this because it looks pretty good. As long as you click X on them, it's fine. But anyway, you can click the decks. It has got some sound, but I did turn it down for the sake of this. Now it's got nearly every card you could think of. I didn't put it into full screen because it can crash the game sometimes. Now, the ban list is quite annoying. You're going to have to host the game to decide if there's a ban list or not. Because if you or your opponent choose it as a ban list, then you cannot choose the cards. Because they they follow by the ban list. <coughs> so if I I can just click no ban list and I'm done. The deck um create your own new deck. So I can just click this YouTube deck done. Now now you gotta make it. This is where over here starts. We can type in any card we really want, and it comes up here easy done. So you drag it in there. There's that. So I'm gonna put three of these in. I'm going to do a couple when I'll skip it, obviously. I'll skip quite a lot of these ones. But, and I'll also put in Black Buster Soldier. Now, as there is loads, you will have to type in maybe um, quite a lot to actually get it. Oh, no, it's not. But be careful because some of the cards do not have the... That's quite rare. But, I mean, there are some cards it doesn't have. But I'm going to just type in some random cards, you know, put them in, make a little deck very quickly and I can show you just a little duel like just like that all right so I'll be back in a minute once I've actually made a deck all right guys I'm back I've now made a deck it's quite simple quite powerful and it's quite good um, and also another cool thing you can actually have the anime cards they don't have anime cards for all of them but you can have them but yet again they can be not allowed in the actual like whoever's playing it but if you say there's they're allowed if you host one of them they're allowed but anyway I'm gonna save it now we're going to exit this, which will yet again exit the tab, but now we want to go to Duel. And now here is where you're going to play all your online games. No no ban list, it says no ban list, or if it says no ban list, stuff like that. But you know there's no ban list. But you click on them and click host or join. And I'll re go through that in another episode. Now we're going to click on single player down here. We, you get to do any of these ones. You get to draw, I um, can't remember his name, um, Marek. Um, Joey, Kaiba, or Yugi. Yugi obviously being the most powerful, or the Dawning Robot deck. We get to choose either Front deck, Horus deck, Dragoonity deck, or the Burn deck. We're going to go against Joey. Now, I'm not going to do the whole duel because I don't want to waste too much time because the video is going to be very long.
Save the replay so you can actually watch it again. We'll save the first game out of the bar. And yeah, and that's it. So anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this whole tutorial and I hope it helped you a lot when actually making it and playing the game. And yes, um anyway guys, I'll see you later. Please rate subscribe if you want any more tutorials like this. Anyways, see you later.